five, four, three, two. Well, I could have continued that intro just a little bit further, but I don't exactly want Miranda Cosgrove to take all my hard-earned ad revenue. So that's all you're going to get. Anyway, this is the decklist I'll be showcasing today, and it's entirely built around the card Earthbound Immortal Asla Piscu. This guy is a level 10 winged beast monster. This is actually very important to the deck, so remember that. He has 2500 attack with the effect, there can only be one Earthbound Immortal on the field at one time and if there is no field spell active, he is destroyed. Your opponent cannot target this card for attacks, but this card can attack your opponent directly. If he ever leaves the field except by his own effect, destroy all face-up monsters your opponent controls, and your opponent takes 800 damage for each. So how are we summoning this boy? Well first off, you'll need a field spell on the board, so he doesn't destroy himself. So you can ignore the field spells I've put in my list and replace them with just about anything else, as it really doesn't matter which field spells you use, just as long as you're using something. Then you'll need any level 4 ninja. Again, doesn't matter which ninjas you use, just as long as they are ninjas, and are level 4. You could even get away with a few level 3s, and you'll understand why in just a bit. You also need the skill Level Augmentation. And finally the trap card, Ninjutsu Art of Transformation. This trap allows you to tribute one ninja monster to special summon a winged beast monster from your hand or deck whose level is equal to or less than the ninja plus three. So the combo for this deck is super simple. Summon a ninja. Use level augmentation on the ninja to increase his level to anywhere above seven. Then activate the trap card to summon a level 10 winged beast also known as Asla. The only other card to mention in this list is Notebook, since literally every other card other than the Immortal and the Trap are replaceable. Basically, it's using this list as a searcher for your trap, by discarding one ninja monster to set it directly from your deck. Alright guys, that's basically it for the Toying Father's video. The rest of this video will just be 5 gameplays showing this deck list in action. If you liked the video, make sure to leave a like, subscribe if you're new around here, comment if you need questions or feedback, thank you for watching, and I hope to see you in the next one. Also, make sure to join my Discord, link at the top of the description.
Hey, big brother, can I watch Spongebob? Shut up, Mokuba. I'm busy flagging YouTube videos to compensate for the fact that I have an extremely small penis. Oh.